In this video, I'm taking a look at the Chrysanthemum Star Wars Funko Pop from the Book of Boba Fett. Let's jump right into it. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Christopher, and this is the Chrysanthemum Star Wars Funko Pop from the Book of Boba Fett. Um, really excited to have this one. I picked up the whole set of the, uh, I guess this is now the second wave of of Book of Boba Fett Funko Pop, so I just did a review on uh, Cad Bane uh, just on Friday there, so uh, this is the next one in the uh, the wave, this is number 581, uh, but let's take a quick look at the packaging here. So there is the front of the box, so as you can see it's the same as the rest of the Book of Boba Fett Funko Pops there, um, so it's got that same uh, green pinstriping around everything, the green uh, border, um, and then you got the, the red medallion and uh, the red medallion behind the series number and Chrysanthemum is number 581 and then you got your usual uh, pop branding Star Wars branding and then you got your usual image of the Funko Pop the name of the Funko Pop there Chrysanthemum and then you do have the the Tatooine skyline there with the twin suns you see, and you'll see that better on the side there so when you move to this side again you got your uh, your Funko Pop branding there again um, the Kersantan Funko Pop there, and you can see uh, Jabba's Palace there in the background. And then moving on to the back, same thing, you got that same Tatooine background there. You got the Star Wars The Book of Boba Fett logo right there. Um, and then the rest of the Funko Pops in the wave. So Cad Bane, Kersantan, Major Domo, Luke Skywalker, Grogu with armor, and the Mandalorian. Um, so I have all of these. Um, I have reviews on all of them coming. I did the review on Cad Bane just on Friday there. Um, there's the other side of the box there, the, your usual Funko Pop uh, side there, nothing nothing too fancy there. And then same at the top there, you got the, the partial image of Chrysanthemum and then the Funko Pop branding there. But let's get this guy out of the packaging and we'll take a closer look at him. There is Chrysanthemum out of the box, and he looks absolutely fantastic. Um, look at that pose on this guy. He just looks absolutely menacing like this in this stance. He's just standing there with his uh, his big blaster in his hands um, in the middle of Moss Espa, just before all the Trandoshans attack him. Um, such a great looking Funko Pop. The the uh, Summer Convention 2022 exclusive, uh, the flocked version, was great. This is even better. Like, I, I just love how the details on this one show up much better over the flocked version. And I'll compare the two in a moment. But uh, just that stance. He just looks so menacing and such great detail. Um, starting starting with his fur and stuff. Like, they did the, the nice gradient paint on his mustache, that two-tone mustache there. Um, you get like the the nice sculpt work on the head there and the fur, and that's something Funko's been getting better at is uh, doing hair and fur a lot better. Um, but look at the uh, the little details on the blaster, like the the gold on the blaster there as well. The little red uh, lights there on the blaster. Um, the blaster itself is a gloss black, but then like the the tip of the blaster, I guess the the end of the blaster muzzle there um is it's um kind of like a gunmetal gray so it kind of looks it, it it looks really really good all together um seeing this in person here but all the gold detail on this guy like they 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 did they, they um spared no expense when it came to to sculpting all this detail on the uh on the bandolier the the belt buckles the the, the knuckle dusters the uh all his armor is in gold. The the sculpt work on the uh, shoulder pad there. Phenomenal work by Funko. Uh, again, the bandolier at the back is gold. His belt is gold. All his hair clips are gold. Um, the pouch is kind of like a matte brown with some dark brown trim, and it, it does. It looks like uh, it looks like fabric. The pouches, and that's another thing I've mentioned in previous reviews where. Um, Funko is doing a great job at making uh, fabric look more fabric-like, even though these are, are plastic uh, figures. So, 
Funko's been doing such a great job. And then there again, they're on the other shoulder pad, that, that uh, sculpt work on there. It just looks phenomenal. Such great work on this Funko Pop. He looks... He looks fantastic. I think this guy's way better than the uh, flocked version. The flocked version, like I said, is is great and all, but this one looks fantastic. Like it, this guy looks ten times better without the flocked. But um, I'm, I'll grab the other one and we'll compare the two right now. All right. So there is the uh, summer convention, 2022 summer convention, uh, Chrysanthemum on the left side of the screen, and the uh, the new Chrysanthemum uh, with the blaster on the right. And like I said, like the the flock version looks cool and all. His stance with the like ready to fight in that uh, in that Madame Garza whips uh, cantina there. Um, but the the non flock version, you get all that detail in it. Like the gold looks so much better um, when it's not flocked. Um, the like I said, the two tone mustache on this guy compared to this guy, like you can't even tell that it's two tone. You can see a little bit there. But this guy looks way better. Um, love the other one too, though. But this one's just way better. If if they combine the two, if they did the uh, the rest of the knuckle dusters, the uh, like his uh, shoulder pads and stuff all sculpted, like this guy here, like this one's got all that detail on the the shoulder pad, where this one doesn't, because it's it's flocked, right? So you can't get that detail. But uh, yeah, no, this this one, even like the belt, like the, they did plastic on the belt on this one. This one's way better. So. A big improvement over the uh, the flocked one for sure. Such a great pop. Really happy to have this one in the collection. But let me know what do you guys think of the Kersantan Star Wars Funko Pop from the Book of Boba Fett. Let me know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and then click to watch one of my other reviews. Thank you so much for watching, and may the Force be with you.